Here's a neat tip for keeping all your best work at your fingertips. And I usually do this through the Adobe Bridge. So here I am in the bridge and I've got a handful of folders. And inside these folders I've got a bunch of you know, different photographs. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, open up, say, the Fire Station folder, grab one of my favorite images, and go ahead under Label and make it five stars. Okay, And then I'm going to go into another folder, say Roger Williams Park here, and I'm going to grab another, let's get two other photos here, and label those with five stars. And the reason I'm giving them these five star labels is because I can then have the bridge constantly scan these folders and pull out my five star material and put it into another subfolder for me. And that's done through a collection. The collections are located in the collections panel down here in the bridge. And at the bottom of the collections panel you have two icons. You can make a new collection or there's uh, a, another icon that has this little tiny gear attached to it. That lets you build a smart collection. The smart collection will allow you to scan uh, the contents of your hard drive or of a folder and find all your five star content and put it into one collection for you. Let me show you how to set this up. I'm going to click on the smart collection button it's going to look in the Smart Collection Demo folder. This is the folder I made on my desktop that contains all the photos we're viewing in the bridge over here. Now normally I scan my entire hard drive and just let the bridge go through all of my content and find my best stuff, but for the sake of, of time for this little demo here, I put it all in, inside of one folder. So I'm just going to scan that demo folder. And then I have to tell it, well what is it that makes this image your best of image. What makes it portfolio worthy? Well I was giving everything a five star rating but you can use different criteria. You can do by keywords, by titles in the document, all sorts of criteria you can go by. I usually just do rating and the rating has to equal reject. Well, that's kinda sad. Uh, let's go for five stars. So earlier I put a five star rating on some of the images. So this is going to scan uh, looking for those images with the five stars. And then I'm going to hit save. And immediately <laughs> it picked up my three images. These are the three images that I gave the five stars to. Now down here it says new smart collection. Let's just call this uh, my best stuff. You, oops, let's get that right. There we go. My best stuff. And now what's going to happen is it's constantly going to scan that folder looking for new five star content. So it'll automatically grab those three images I did a moment ago. Now if I go back to the Smart Collections folder and I go to say a different folder like the bike path here. Let's scroll on down and see if there's anything worth grabbing here. Uh, we'll take this image. I'll give that five stars. Let's go back to the Smart Collections. Let's go back into the park. Let's grab this one. We'll give that five stars. And we'll give that, well, let's grab this one up here. We'll give that five stars. And what else do we have? I think we have some beach images here. Let's uh, grab this. And we'll grab some rocks right here. Give those five stars. And now, when I go back to my smart collection of my best stuff, there it is. It's like magic. So this is a nice way of, you know, if you come up with a system, in my case, a rating of five stars, anything you like, any piece of work you like, you give it a five star rating and it will automatically go into this collection. So you can immediately find your best work, your portfolio worthy stuff right at your fingertips. Not only does it work on image files, it also works with pretty much everything else. For example, here I have a Word document. Let's say that was important. I can give that five stars. Here I have a website. This uh, askriley.net is the root directory of a website. If I open it up, you'll see the index file and then all subfolders with all the content for that site. If I give that five stars, that folder and all of its content will go into my smart collection. The same thing with this. This QuickTime booklet is uh, InDesign files. And InDesign files, just like a website, usually have dependencies that go along with them. So I'm going to go ahead and label 
this whole folder five stars. And now when I go to my best stuff, all that stuff is in there. I've got my web folder with all of its dependencies. I got my InDesign folder uh, with the InDesign files and all their dependencies. I got this Word document here. So it works with everything. Uh, Illustrator files, movie files, photos, folders. So it's not uh, biased to just working with images. You can use it for anything. So it's a nice way of uh, getting all your work uh, collected together in, in one location at your fingertips so you can pull it up at a moment's notice. And as a quick note for all you Lightroom users, it works in there too. Bingo!